Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna pour on a mirror frame. I cleaned it very well. I even uh, used dish soap to get all the fat off. It had kind of an antique look, so that all needed to go. You can also sand it or guess it, but as soon as that is all gone, you should be fine. I'm mainly gonna use white and blue with a bit of gold and bronze because I made the nightstand and the customer wanted it to look similar, so have a look at that video. I think it turned out pretty nice. I don't want to make just a line from the left to the right, up and down. I want to more have a pattern that moves from the middle to the outside, so I'm going to spread it a little bit different. Every color has silicone, and I'm going to just layer them and show you how I do it. The little problem you have when you pour out of a big cup is that, as you can see here, the color you start with is relatively dark in this case, and the more you get to the bottom of the cup, it gets lighter. And I don't want that, so I'm gonna spread over it a, a little bit more. I also had a little rest of paint that I'm gonna use that is gonna look more even. I'm gonna torch it already now to first of all pop some air bubbles but also to create the cells while the paint is still layered up that when I move it now I'm gonna stretch out the cells that already exist. The tilting is of course a bit complicated on a frame like that and it's a bit a waste of paint. You could put something under it or you could make skins from what is running over but you basically yeah, you need to tilt it from uh, to have everything covered. You can see now that the pattern I wanted turned out really nicely. It is the stripes going from the middle to the outside. Uh, to fix the sides, I'm gonna use a palette knife and pick up the paint carefully with the pattern it has already there and slightly put it against the sides and pull down that the paint can really get attached to it. Again, some more torching now to pop the air bubbles and to create some more cells. 
and then it's basically already done. Gonna give you a close up and a picture of the final item. Thanks for watching. Come back, give it a thumbs up, leave a nice comment, and hope to see you back soon.